We are previewing week 14 here at SBR Forum Videos. I'm Peter Loshak, and we're talking right now with returning guest Troy West from AllPlaysWin.com, who did it again last week. Another winning week with us, 2-1. and one. His record overall has been absolutely phenomenal this year. Troy, thanks for being back with us. Thanks, Pete. You know, it's been, it's been a great weekend. It's unfortunate I can only get to do a few plays with you guys every weekend, but uh, we're continuing to win over here. We're feeling great. We've had a great couple last days, and um, it, it, it's continuing here. It's continuing. I hope we can have another great weekend with you guys. Yeah, it's unfortunate that you've had your second straight 2-1 uh, week in a row with us, though. Let's get a 3-0 and week this week, okay, Troy? Let's do it. Let's All right, let's it. do it. All right. First game you want to talk about, college game, Oklahoma at TCU. TCU is a six-and-a-half point home underdog. TCU is off of the big win off of Texas. Oklahoma is off of, of course, their rivalry game where they got the win but didn't get the cover. They do need uh, the win to keep their Big 12 hopes alive, though. Uh, you know, TCU has a couple of extra days rest, though. I'm thinking unless there's some sort of uh, talent discrepancy that I'm not factoring in here, I'm thinking TCU plus six-and-a-half has small but maybe a little bit of value. I'm going with Oklahoma, Pete. Yeah, I love okay. Oklahoma in this game. I'm watching in the last two games, they put up 51 against Oklahoma State. The week before, they put up 50 against West Virginia. The last four games, they're well over the 40s. I just think, I know TCU's got a better defense, and I know they're going to test Oklahoma, but I think Landry Jones has got these guys clicking. I watched that receiving core. They look like an NFL-style offense. Mm -hmm. TCU has not really beaten anybody that wows you all year. They lose 36-14 to Oak State. You know, they, they've, they've had a few games where you just kind of look at the score and you're wondering what the heck happened. I think Bob Stutz has got these guys playing good football. I think Oklahoma beats them by two touchdowns in, the, in this game. Really? All right, I'll just play devil's advocate because I trust you implicitly. Uh, you know, Landry Jones for Oklahoma, obviously, most of the time he's great, but he is prone to mistakes and kind of like, you know, a little bit unsteady at times. Uh, also, TCU does have a few extra days rest. And Oklahoma, you know, I mean, maybe it's a letdown spot. They do need a win here. I understand that. But, you know, they, uh, they, they didn't cover against Oklahoma State. And, uh, you know, maybe they're, they're exhaling a little bit after that uh, high-scoring uh, Bedlam game. You might be right. And I didn't like the fact that they went to overtime. It, it took an emotional win for them to come back. But I think they're at that point where they do know the implications of this football game. I think they're lucky to get out of with a win against Oklahoma State. And you look, I just think the talent level of Oklahoma is much higher than TCU. TCU's got four notable losses this year, and, and they really don't have that win that wows you. Mm -hmm. And I just think Oklahoma, you know, they're rolling in with, with nine and two wins, nine wins, two losses. I think Oklahoma wins this football game. I think they're better. I think TCU hasn't been tested by an offense like this this all year. I think Oklahoma wins this football game. I think you're looking at a score like a 31 to 14, 38 20 type game. Oklahoma's offense looked phenomenal the last two weeks. You put up 51 against West, or excuse me, against Oklahoma State, and then put up 50 against West Virginia. There's something to be said for that. I think Oklahoma wins the game, Pete. All right, the the, the TCU win over uh, Texas didn't wow you. Didn't you didn't see that uh, you know final score and go. Wow. Texas has been weird all year, though. Texas has been yeah. extremely inconsistent. Oklahoma destroyed Texas. You remember that one earlier this year. Um, so, I, again, I just think Oklahoma, you look at some of the comparisons all year long, Oklahoma's beaten a lot of the teams bad that TCU's beaten. Oklahoma State's one of them. Oklahoma State went in and, and beat, beat up TCU pretty good. And, yeah, o, you know, Oklahoma only takes down OSU by three, but I still think there's a talent discrepancy here. I think Bob Stoops is a better coach. I think Oklahoma wins the football game by two touchdowns. All right. If you say Oklahoma minus six snaps aside, that's the side I'm going with. Thanks so much. Troy West from allplayswin.com.